Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to this very special session of snooker. We're turning back the clock to bring out two legends of the game who went toe-to-toe -to -toe in 1985. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome, first of all, a true hero of the modern game. He won the Grand Prix in 1984. He won the Masters in 1987, beating Alex Higgins. What a match. 19 million of us tuned in in 1985. He was 8 nil down. It was the black ball. It was after midnight. He is the pride of Northern Ireland. Dennis Taylor! <laughs> to see the uh, glasses are getting smaller. Um, I thought your introduction was absolutely spot on, Rob. <laughs> I feel silly talking serious with these glasses on. Only you could get away with it. <laughs> and now, please welcome what a fantastic 12 days he's had here at the Crucible. He is one of snooker's greats, the ultimate ambassador for his sport. This was his 30th year at the Crucible. He's won a record 81 professional titles, six times a world champion, six times a UK champion. 25 years ago, he was the nugget. Now, he's simply a legend. Steve Davis. Good work, Steve. Thank you. Some of these products work quite quickly. <laughs> I'm not sure the hair was that big uh, 25 years ago. Uh, before we talk about uh, the final in 85... It was marvellous, but obviously we're not here to, today to talk about that. Could you take in the enormity of what was happening at the time? No, not really. <laughs> well, Dennis certainly enjoyed it, but uh, he said that snooker was the winner that night. Would you agree? Uh, uh, um, yes, I think so, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I think that you know, it captured the imagination of the public and it was marvellous uh, and I was so pleased for Dennis. Um, <laughs> and uh, yeah, I think snooker, well, yeah, I definitely think you know, it was part of folklore history now. And... Amazing. And is it true, just finally, before we see this epic one frame showdown, that you kicked Dennis off the practice table earlier this week because you had a quarter final to contest? <laughs> Obviously, if I'd have made the semi-finals, this wouldn't have been happening. I walk in at six o'clock to have my practice before the match in the evening. Who's on the practice table preparing for the next day? Dennis. <laughs> <laughs> what a sign of confidence building that was for me. <laughs> Amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Steve Davis, Dennis Taylor, let's play snooker! like Mick Hucknell with that wig on. <laughs> uh, is it a quick photo? OK, right. Then. Oh, I went up on the tiptoes, I remember. You remember oh, yeah, I was funny. Thank you. The first frame, <clears throat> Dennis Taylor. Book. What do you mean, the first frame? Yeah, that was the only frame. <laughs> A good long red in. Try to get under the pink in the middle. Unlucky. In the middle. Oh. Foul. Oh. And a miss. 25 years ago, John. It Steve almost seems like yesterday. Six. I think you'll find there were no misses. Oh, well, no. <laughs> <laughs> that was a perfectly good shot back then. Yeah, I know it was then. 
Well, Are we wanna... reenacting this? <laughs> 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 if you think the Miss Rule shouldn't apply, press <laughs> pulse now. <laughs> Taking it seriously, I didn't know. It's <laughs> <laughs> a safety shot. Cliff Thorburn's here. We've got to, we've got to play a few, a few dump shots as oh, well. A few, <laughs> a few safety shots for Cliff. Well, I wonder whether Steve will attempt to pot this red and flick the red away from the this black is a and start the black. Never played in his career. <laughs> 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 Well, I can only presume the black must put in the left-hand right. corner. And there, there's the legend Cliff Thorburn. You know, when the commentators say, oh, that's a bad miss, and, and the, the top pockets are, look quite easy on the television? Let's find out. <laughs> it's a twitchy one of you, Cliff. Isn't it? <laughs> and that's <laughs> a bad miss. <laughs> that was a bad miss. <laughs> Get him. You can't be that lucky again, Steve. You well. You've been lucky all his life. <laughs> You haven't left me the rest. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't think you can say we lucky 25 years ago. I'm useless ago. with the rest, mate. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Did the red go in? <laughs> yes, it's official. He is still the worst player in the world with the rest. Don't worry. <laughs> I've got a kick. <laughs> Seven. Even though he's smiling, he's not happy with that. <laughs> it's mainly wind. <laughs> oh, shut <sorry>. Six. <laughs> One of the greatest shots of nothings I've ever seen. <laughs> City. Hello, City. <laughs> Eugene, where's the fitter? <laughs> I wonder if I got it there. Oh, don't get too advanced. <laughs> Brown will get back up to his own I'm spot and he's going to have to hope ahead. there's a <laughs> gap between the yellow and... Brown. <laughs> Foul and a miss. <laughs> Steve Davis one, Dennis Taylor four. Foul and a miss. <laughs> <clears throat> Since I've taken my hair off, I've lost a lot of strength. Dennis <laughs> oh. <laughs> Taylor one. John Parrott, stop laughing. <laughs> When we first heard of this, we thought, what a great idea this will be. Put in the green. Brown. He's having another go at the brown. I reckon it's going to go. He's trying to get in between the gap of the four reds on the left and round the back of the pink. So keep an eye on the cue ball here. It's going to go in between the gap there, round the back. Oh, oh. That, was, that would have been really close. Oh. Steve Brown, the back nine, of the Dennis pink, Taylor, that would have been four. close. It may look stupid, you say that look really it close. He hit the red arm <laughs> ball. But it was going to be there, John. <laughs> Brown. <laughs> <laughs> Same shot. Oh, no, the black's in the room. Ooh. Tight pocket, see? <laughs> Red. Red. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to figure out which is the easiest. <laughs> I'm not bothered by position. <laughs> I haven't had as much fun since the pigs ate one of my sisters. <laughs> That's officially a break. <laughs> oh, I got a kick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Apparently, this match is, is being shown live in China. <laughs> Seriously, can you imagine what the commentary's like? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Green.
Another double. This is where the tension really ratches up a couple of notches. <laughs> Microphone battery pack to play. <laughs> Steve Davis is a little bit too old to get his leg over. <laughs> it's all right, they won't get that in China. <laughs> He'll go another shade of red after this shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Steve Davis, three. Oh, that's a bit tight, this one. <laughs> Might have to swerve around the yellow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a... Hawkeye thinks that's a snooker. <laughs> That was a good putt. He didn't oh. do that in 85. He's hampered. He's hampered. Could Word play the of 2000, with the rest. on the Comedy World, hampered. What, they haven't got a Along with there. every credit, flat back pack, <laughs> frame winning opportunity. Oh, he got go. a kick. <laughs> <clears throat> I've seen... <laughs> Dennis Taylor won. I've seen some crap shots in my time. <laughs> That was, that was up there. <laughs> oh, no. I think there's every chance of this being a black ball game, the oh. way we're going. I twitched. Steve Davis, too. <laughs> that I twitched. Three. Be careful now. I'm sure I was in front by this stage. <laughs> On a string. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad miss. <laughs> That's a terrible... Oh, that's so lucky you. <laughs> it was a come on stage. Four. And he's developed oh. the blue. That will do. Close to the pot. And set the other way around. So Dennis Taylor's got the blue to once again beat Steve Davis as a crucible. This is still anybody's, don't worry about that. <laughs> Isn't it, when you just, the last ball when you need it, isn't it hard? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, wait till you get to the black. <laughs> Shot. <laughs> and Steve Davis still in the frame, and I think Dennis could find himself snookered here. Oh, yes, I am. Oh, yeah. I think I will be. I know. I'm playing this. Don't worry about that. <laughs> oh, no! Oh. Oh, yes. <laughs> Don't go in the middle pocket, Pink. <laughs> no! Oh. <laughs> Five or six. <laughs> Pink. <laughs> Come on, you beaut. Yes. Yes. Oh! Oh! Wow, what an effort. What an effort. <laughs> nah, no foul in. Is that a miss? He <laughs> wasn't even a foul, Steve. Great shot. Uh, was it a miss? Yeah. Yeah, put it, put it back again. Thank you. Put it back. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> At least it's going to be a black ball game now, and he may even play the black <laughs> off three cushions again. Just watch the way he plays this black again. Play and so it came to pass <laughs> that the match ended up on the black, and the white ball ended up you're, with good positional play, obviously. <laughs> About there. And then what did you do? I came out of my seat. Yeah, you did. <laughs> well, no, I was out of my seat because I just potted the pink. Oh, yeah, of course you did. <laughs> <laughs> I went over and I mm, kissed that there. And I thought. And I came round and I thought, go for the double. This is what I played. Um, oh. <laughs> He's done it again. <laughs> now, what happened? The black hit there. <laughs> Are you at that end of the table? I don't know where it was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, OK, yeah, 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 I think so. I'll leave him to it. Down here. No, I think perhaps it was down at this end. The other way yeah, around, yeah. yeah, there we go. <laughs> and I thought, what a lucky person he is. <laughs> In the face shot, and the black, I was very pleased to see, went nowhere along the line it's going now, and it <laughs> ended up there. And the white was here. Yeah, what a shot I played there. And I was sitting. <laughs> no, 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 please, no, please. <laughs> and I used to say things under my breath, you know, things that uh, people didn't want to hear, really. <laughs> but it was, he just missed the double kiss by a fraction. And I remember coming to the table, saying to myself, that's the greatest shot I've ever seen under pressure in my life. <laughs> or words to that effect. <laughs> it was more like your jammy gingerhead. Um... <laughs> I played the straightforward safety shot. <laughs> I tried to double the black into this pocket here. And I hit it hard enough. If it didn't go in there, I might fluke it in there. You see what I was dealing with? So this is what I played. <laughs> How many times do you want to win this thing? <laughs> so, obviously, after missing the double, he was bound to leave me a shot. <laughs> That's what I had. <laughs> And I'm thinking to myself, use all the years of experience. Keep your head still, don't lift your head. Push the cue in and out four or five times and you're world champion. And this was the shot I played after all those positive thoughts. <laughs> I got down, keep your head still, push the cue in and out four or five times and this is what happened. <laughs> oh, I, I, I mean, you couldn't have got further. It was about Rotherham he missed it by. <laughs> the black was probably ended up about here, and the white ball roughly about here. I had a chance to cut the black <laughs> to win the world championship. <laughs> I think it was like that. It no. may have been a bit closer. I don't know. <laughs> well, it was like that. OK, fair enough. <laughs> It was somewhere in between. Somewhere in between. So, it, well, and, and there is, there's a lot of argument about it, and obviously Hawkeye sort of... I have an argument with Hawkeye about it, but... <laughs> it's... I don't know where it was. It, 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 you know, but anyway, I was in my chair. <laughs> and I, saw, I thought, I can pop this. <laughs> and I started walking and realised that it, they weren't my legs. <laughs> and it was all a bit slow motion -y. And I came to the table chalking somebody else's cue. <laughs> and I gripped hold of the cue with Jimmy White's right hand. <laughs> it, it wasn't my hand. And I thought, whatever you do, this is a very thin shot, under pressure, whatever you do, don't hit it thick. That's how you bottle it. Don't hit it thick. 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 Don't... And I didn't. <laughs> I hit it thin. <laughs>
very thin. <laughs> so thin that the white ball had a lot more speed on it. <laughs> <laughs> and the black didn't the go in. The black... <laughs> because I didn't win that year. <laughs> the black hit there, hit there, and went to there, and the white ball came up the table, went there, and a few people, my friends, went, there, there. <laughs> and I looked up at somebody who, who got a free ticket up the balcony and didn't pay and walked back to my chair. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> and I got down without gripping the cue, let it go very loose, took ages on the shot and missed the black... <laughs> to the table, <laughs> got down, with all the years of experience, <laughs> and put it over the middle pocket, yeah. which is where Dennis finally potted it. So this one I couldn't miss. you never seen this bit, did you? <laughs> Of the black, and I went like <laughs> I just never get fed up with people talking about it, and uh, <laughs> every time I sort of play with Steve and I meet him and shake hands, he always wants to talk about it. <laughs> Well, yeah, I mean, my psychoanalyst has been working on, <laughs> on me trying to forget it, but uh, with no success so far. I, I mean, I, I know how much you enjoy it, because I sit next to you in the studio, and every time it gets mentioned in commentary or it comes up on a piece of VT, you really like it, don't you? <laughs> well, look, look I'll... <laughs> <laughs> Tell the truth. I'll tell you what, it's, it's history. Uh, I was pleased to be part of it in the end. Ladies and gentlemen, Dennis Saylor and Steve Davis. Thank you. Thank you.